to programming knowledge hope you're all doing good so back with another tutorial in which we are going to today look at the speech recognition using google speech recognition <clears throat> so let's get started with writing down the code for identifying the voice and converting it into text using google speech recognition so before writing down the code, I would suggest you to install the Py Audio and uh, Py Speech uh, libraries uh, inside the PyCharm. And along with that, you need to have the speech recognition module for implementing this program and uh, uh, like for using the voice into text. So let's go ahead and start writing the program. As first, I'm going to import speech recognition and provide it as SR. So as I have uh, available availability of speech recognition, so I'm going to import the speech recognition as SR. The next step, what we are going to do is we are going to use a variable called R, and inside that we are going to use SR dot recognizer by using recognizer, and inside this. Here we go. We have used the SR recognizer, and inside this, we are going to use the width SR dot microphone as a source. Here we go. We have used SR dot microphone as a source, and I'm going to use the print statement. And provide as say something. And lastly, I'm going to use another thing called audio as a variable. And inside this, I'm going to use r dot listen and uh, use the source. Pass on the source. Okay, so we have passed on the source. Now, speech recognition using Google speech recognition, and inside that this try, we are going for testing purposes. We are going to use the exceptions, which I have already written down. You can view it. So inside the try statement, I have first used the print and. Uh, <clears throat> as printed as you said uh, once we are going to like uh, once we are going to record let's say like hello world as it will uh, be displaying as you said hello world and uh, the commonly we use that all dot recognize underscore google of uh, and inside the brackets we are going to pass on the audio which we have created inside that we have all dot listen and uh, source and uh, inside the exceptions we have used the speech recognition which we imported which we have imported uh, and by using dot unknown value error it will be displaying as google speech recognition could not understand audio if uh, uh, we are not we, if we are not able to record the audio properly or the yeah so and uh, another request uh, exception we have created is by using the sr that is speech recognition and uh, by using dot request error as e providing as e as a part and uh, inside that we use could not request results from google speech recognition service and uh, by using the value and by using dot format of e which we have defined it over here as e so we are going to pass the e inside the format of e so by using the simple lines of code we, are, we can be easily able to use the google speech recognition and uh, yeah so we can record and uh, convert that into text so now let's go ahead and run the program and see uh, the expected output which is uh, it will be asking for say something and followed by where uh, it will uh, be recording the audio by listening to our voice whatever we are saying and uh, lastly it will be displaying into the text format by using the use it as a keyword so let's go ahead and run the program so we are going to run the program now here we go it's asking for say something hello world 
ओके तो या एज आई सेड बिफोर वी ट्राइड लाइक आई सेड वीवो इज आस्किंग फॉर समथिंग लेट्स गो एंड रन अगेन रन द प्रोग्राम हेलो वर्ल्ड हेलो वर्ल्ड Oops. Oops. As you can see, uh, we are not. Uh, the Google is not understanding the recognition service. Now I am going to refresh this program. Let's know. No, again I am going to run this program. Okay. Hello world. Here we go. As expected, we use the uh, "Hello World" and uh, it is displaying as "Hello World." In the earlier, uh, while running the program, in the earlier part, uh, I was trying to uh, tell you that uh, it's asking for "Say something," so it was predicting as "We will say something." So it was taking down my voice when I said that. So now, when I run the program again and I say it as "Hello World," so it's displaying as "Hello World." and if it does not recognize our voice so it will it will uh, take down the other values in the program which is i'd like to tell you that so google speech recognition could not understand audio and followed by could not request results from google speech recognition service okay so try this code and uh, run this program for your purpose uh, where you want to record the uh, audio and uh, display it into text format so hope you like this program and uh, try running the program so that's it for today in the coming tutorials we'll be coming uh, with exciting stuff thank you for joining with programming knowledge see you in next tutorials bye guys